you know, as a military child, I'll put this down, um, we always try to help wherever we can. And my mother's in San Antonio. She's a colon hydrotherapist. She has a little center. And uh, most of her clients... The eldest of all of the therapists are, who are members of IAC. Exactly. Yeah. She, we got an accolade for her. Yeah. Next to Connie, the founder. Uh -huh. My mother is the oldest. She's the oldest. Participating wow. yeah. colon hydrotherapist for IAC, and I'm very proud of that. Yeah. She's older than all her clients. And when they call, they say, "Miss Lee, do you feel like doing colonics today?" And if she says no, they say, "Well, we'll wait on you until you feel better." Yeah. So <laughs> that's the kind of rapport they have with mom. Yeah. But the greatest part about what we do is if we can get uh, the amputee that I'm working with now and uh, in the future to under to see the benefit I have three amputees that I work with now one is a veteran and then the other two are just uh, you know civilians but we have such good testimonies for them and then with my dad being an a W amputee from the VA uh, with 25 years service I saw firsthand how this would be such a benefit to other amputees and they use so much medication and no movement and no movement and it's not a field that we're taking from someone we're adding to it yeah. and the VA is already outsourcing all their GI problems so my thing is if you're outsourcing just take a look at what we have to offer how long we've been around and how the struggle has to make sure everything is clean sanitized educated and so that we don't trample on another profession yeah. and we have treaded the grounds 